another video with your buddy the Willow Coast Cracker. And today I have another tutorial for you guys. And the overwhelming requested tutorial that you guys wanted is how to build a Connects lift tail. So right here I have just a mock lift tail right here, very short. But it doesn't matter how short or how big it is, it's all the same principle. All it really is, you want it to work like this. Okay. All right, so the main things you're gonna need for a lift hill is obviously you need the chain, you need this chain wheel. This is basically a black chain wheel right here that comes in any Connects roller coaster kit. Um, and then you will obviously need a motor. I have these two gears right here just to make the lift hill go faster, but that's a whole other thing we can get into later. But really you just need a motor and you can hook that up to the rod that is right next to the actual gear right here. So the main thing you wanna do is for, um, I typically put the motor at the bottom of the lift hill because it's more powerful rather than it being at the top. And this thing is very weighted because so when you put this at the top of the lift hill, it'll start to weigh your coaster down. So what I do is I just put the motor down here, put this whole contraption down here. So the main thing you want to do with your bottom gear of the lift hill is you want to make sure it's right here at the bottom of one of these bars. So as you see, the track has multiple splits right here. You want to make sure the wheel is directly under one of the bar the bars like kind of in a diagonal way I'm showing an infographic right here to kind of demonstrate what I mean you want it right here so that way the chain runs smoothly through and it's not like jagged or anything because whereas if you have your chain say coming in a few holes down like this oops where if you have your chain coming in like this as you can see there's like a giant bump right here and that's not going to make for a smooth lift hill so you want to make sure the chain wraps all the way around the gear like this and then through one of the slits just like that, so that way it is able to run smoothly. So for the top, it's the same principle. Obviously, there is no motor up here. It's just another gear. What you have right here, there is a maybe a little bit of bump of a bump at the top of your lift hill, but that's all right. You just want to make sure it runs as smooth as possible. And same principle as the bottom, right under one of the slits. So that way, the chain runs all the way around the gear and then back to the full cycle. Uh, one other thing you want to do is you want to make sure you have. Your chain guys, these are these little black extensions that essentially they just snap right onto the track. I place these over any little connecting support that is connecting the track to whatever support you have. I'd say connect it onto there so that way the chain doesn't bump into the support connection and then it is able to again run smoothly. As you can see, smoothness is key in your lift hills. You want to do that. If you don't have a smooth lift hill, your riders are not going to be pleased at all. So just a quick review before I go. Obviously you need your motor, your chain your gears and also chain guides right here place these on all the supports or as many as possible on top of wherever the track is connected to uh, your support system make sure your gears are right under one of the track slits that way your chain will run smoothly both at the top and the bottom right here and then you will just have a lift tilt that will go smooth like this simple as that so that's pretty much gonna round up this tutorial. Let me know in the comments section below if you guys have any questions about if you're having problems with your lift hill, I'd be more than happy to help. Also, you can DM me at, on Instagram at RollercoasterCrafter, no spaces or caps, just DM me there. And also be sure to follow my page for exclusive looks of anything Connects Roller Coasters based on this channel. And also don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel for more videos as I'll keep them coming. Thank you guys, I'll see you next time on the Coaster Crafter channel. Peace! Questions about the lift hills, I am pleased to uh, answer. <laughs> but I'll, I'll, I'll do that again. Okay.